I really hope I don't have to make this video more than once this summer. Or again in my life time. But this is a PSA for the summer. It shouldn't even have to be said. But when you take your kids to any sort of event, especially with surrounding water, watch them. Don't take your eyes off them even for a second. Now, that being said, my husband is right there, so I'm not alone. Things can happen even in a splash pad in seconds. Like, literally seconds. Whether it be trip and fall, and then um, hit their head and then drown. Whether it be a stranger comes and steals your child. Or there is the woods right there. There is the street. I'm right. Really hungry. Awesome. Yeah. There is the street. Not go yet. Don't leave them alone. Don't expect other people to watch your kids. Sure, if you ask, great. I'll watch your kid 100% if you ask me. If you just walk away and you're gone for 20 minutes because you have to go to the bathroom or you have another child that you have to go attend to or whatever the case may be, please let someone know that you're going to be gone. I just about had a heart attack at this spot. It just opened today and I'm already anxiety driven. Like I feel like I am having a panic attack over this. There was this little girl, she's about two, and we got here and she was not here and then she came and we were getting right and ready to get into the splash pad and next thing you know she's alone and I'm looking around and I don't see a parent and I don't see a parent and I don't see a parent 5, 10, 15 minutes, 20 minutes go by I'm freaking out, she's falling, she's crying she's me is bleeding um, she's not hurt, she's just scared. I go into the community center because I'm like, okay, well, she's got a little bit of blood on her. She's, you know, freaking out. She doesn't know where her parent is. But I don't know where her parent is. And they knew who I was talking about, sadly, right away. And that even more makes me mad because if you're gone, if you're, you're a known offender. This is a great neighborhood. It's a great community. It's a great safe place to live. But you know what? Stuff happens. Every day you hear about stuff happening, even in the safest of neighborhoods. And as a bereaved mother, I don't want that upon anybody, okay? So I know my circumstances were definitely not were definitely right or clear, buddy. Different than than this, but I just want to put it out there. Don't, please don't, please don't leave your kid alone, okay? Don't leave them alone in a pool. Don't leave them alone in a mall. I talked about this actually two weeks ago in the vlog that when we were at the mall, I could have taken at least five or ten kids because it was a PD day and kids were just running everywhere and parents weren't watching them and I get that when you have multiples or when you have more than one child, stuff happens. I get it, I get it, I get it a hundred thousand times over. But I don't know, I just can't, I just can't. I can't imagine the worst. And I've read a lot of books, I've seen a lot of movies, I've read a lot of art news articles, and you hear about it every single day, things happening. And I don't want to be involved in that, and I don't want to have to read that. And so I'm just saying, please, please, please watch a child. Okay, I'm not judging anyone, and I'm actually going to turn the comments off on this video, and the thumbs up and thumbs down, because I feel like people are going to be like, well, who are you to judge, blah, 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 blah. Or it could go the other way, like the people who we're also here freaking out um they hang on a second they were hang on they were 
thanking me over and over again in the community center the lady thanked me, but I don't want this to be about me. Hi. Hi. I love you. Thank you for taking good care of that little girl. You're, you're a very good kid. Right? Yeah. Hey, happy summer. Happy summer! <laughs> okay, we're gonna go. I love you. I love you.